Good afternoon, gentlemen. This is your second English assessment task for Year 9 English. It is for the representations of war topic. The mode is viewing and writing. We are issuing it to you on week 11 in term 1, and it is due in week 5 in a lesson set by your class teacher. The marks are 20. Look, it's worth 20 marks, and the weight is 25% of your entire English mark for the year. So a very important assessment. Um, the outcomes addressed are um, EN51A, EN52A, EN53B, and EN57D. Now, the rubric, you'll be marked on your ability to critically analyse the prescribed war text and make connections with the task stimulus, which is the, the John Steinbeck quote. Um, you will need to identify and explain film techniques and their effect on the meaning, the meaning that you draw from the stimulus your thesis statement. You will need to demonstrate an understanding of how different film texts represent war, um, i.e. how the composer um, wished to represent war as something heroic or as, as some, something pitiable, whatever that composer wanted to, um, wanted to say through their text. You will need to write an essay using the correct features. That means a, a, an introduction, a conclusion, and three excellent steel body paragraphs. Now the actual task is you are to choose one of the following film extracts for analysis, Saving Private Ryan on Omaha Beach, or the French, the extract from the French film, A Very Long Engagement, Attack at the Somme. Okay, both historical film extracts. Once you've chosen your extract, you are to write an essay which answers the following question. All war is a symptom of man's failure as a thinking animal. To what extent do you agree with this statement? All right, the key word here, or phrase, is to what extent. Um, you'd be required to, to engage with the question in the sense of you're not saying, you're not simply agreeing with the statement, you are, you are redefining the question to say how, how all, are all wars a symptom of man's failure or are only some wars, in what circumstances is war justifiable and um, link it back to this keyword of failure, keywords of failure and thinking. Okay, are wars um, the result of, of forethought or what circumstances brings human beings into a war situation? Okay, so do not simply agree with the statement. That will not make for a very interesting essay. Now, you must write an essay of between 800 and 1,000 words. That means between 800 and 1,000 words. You are encouraged to write to the word limit. Use the word, number of words you've been given. You need to identify the film extract you've chosen and the composer, of course, and this should appear in your introduction. You need to identify at least four film techniques and explain the significance and effect of each one in terms of the essay question and your original thesis. You need to use steel paragraphs to explain how your chosen techniques contribute to the overall meaning of the film extract, which you need to know beforehand. You need to have that strong thesis statement beforehand in order to uh, effectively use your evidence. Now, submission, a hard copy of your essay must be submitted to your class teacher on the due date in 12 point times New Roman font with 1.5 line spacing. You need to write the word count at the end of the essay, of course, and you also need to submit a cover sheet and a marking criteria with your essay. So please write that in as a comment for yourself, marking criteria and cover sheet to be submitted with each essay. Please do not use plastic sleeves or folders. Simply print and uh, staple your essay. All sleeves and folders will be, um, will be uh, discarded if you do submit in that way. Now the marking criteria. We all want to get up into this extensive A band. So you need to demonstrate an extensive ability to select and analyze a war film extract for intended meaning using the required meta language. That means your film language and the the, the lexus of, of war that you've been learning through this unit. You need to demonstrate a sophisticated understanding of the stimulus. That means not simply accepting the question, but redefining it to suit your own purposes. You need to demonstrate an extensive understanding of how war is represented in film. Okay, This, this requires you to be watching that extract many times and um, to be bringing your knowledge of film to that extract. You need to have a sophisticated essay. So maybe you are you are um, um, combining three or four techniques in the in the one body paragraph. You are 
doing a beautiful introduction and conclusion which reiterates your excellent ideas of the um, introduction. Okay, so it's sophisticated. This is a very high quality essay. Now down to the B range, still a very good range. Um, demonstrates a thorough ability to select and analyze a war film extract for intended meaning and uses the meta language thoroughly. Demonstrates a thorough understanding of the stimulus. Okay, maybe not this this um, sophisticated understanding, but a thorough understanding of the, the stimulus, and demonstrates a thorough understanding of how war is represented in film and a thorough use of the essay text types, which means the essay does everything that it needs to do. However, it might not get into this um, insightful and sophisticated range. However, with um, thoughtful drafting, there is no reason why you could not get into the A band, seeing as you have the essay question beforehand and you have the stimuli beforehand. Um, writing is rewriting boys. So get started on this early. Now the C, the sound range. Okay, a lot of boys fall into this range because they have not drafted enough and because they, they um, start work on their essay too late. So don't, don't be that student. Demonstrates a sound ability to, analyze, to select and analyze a warm film and extract. Demonstrates a sound understanding of the stimulus. Demonstrates a sound understanding of how war is represented in film and a sound use of the essay text type. Okay, so you might be missing some elements of um, the essay that would get you into the B range. For example, your conclusion could be too short, or your introduction um, might not contain your thesis statement. Structural elements like that. Okay, in your D range, um, at this um, stage of your studies, not many of you should be in the D range, considering you have the essay well, topic well beforehand. Demonstrates a basic ability to select and demonstrates a basic ability to describe a war film extract, basic understanding of the stimulus and a basic understanding of how war is represented in film and a very rudimentary use of the essay text type, which means you're doing the bare minimum for this text type to be an essay. Now elementary, again, um, this is a, a student who really has not used their time wisely and is really um, not engaging with the question, so I don't expect any of you will be in this elementary or elementary level. Um, any more questions, ask your teachers. You will receive feedback personalised from your teacher and you will also receive um, feedback for the whole cohort. Good luck, gentlemen, and use your planning time um, and writing time wisely. Thank you.